Spruce Wood Falcons, thank you third grade for doing our Star Spangled Banner. This week is January 13th through 17th. Let's go to kindergarten for the letter of the week. Hi, my name is Hiram. I'm with Ollie and Vivian from Miss Willie's class. Can you tell me what the letter of the week is? Um, oh. Um, what sound does it make, Vivian? Ah. What are some things that start with sure oh um Ollie? Olive. What else? Ollie. What else? Ostrich. <laughs> Thank you, kindergarten. Our December CO students are kindergarten Jacob Donald Piper, first grade, Cam Cameron. Bentley Sky Sky, second grade, Declan Ella Jack, third grade, Maylie Asher, fourth grade, Taylor Robert Cash, fifth grade, Amelia Hiram Delilah. Thank you students for showing us what showing us what respect looks like. Now to our reporter for our story highlights. I'm here with Mrs. Bronson. Mr. Bronson, how do you see perseverance in your classroom? Well, I see it all the time. I see it when kids are working hard to get things done. It, it's perseverance means that you're going to continue to work at something even when it's hard. Even when you're not sure what to do, you might give it a try. You might use a strategy. We learn lots of things about strategies in class. So I always tell kids, Go to your strategies. Think about um, those things and keep trying. How, how will you help you choose your winner, CEO winner? Well, um, that's going to help me choose my CEO because I'm going to be watching for kids who have that skill. So if they're able to use their strategies to figure something out instead of stomping and wadding up their paper or something like that, they're going to try their strategy and they're going to keep on going or they're going to ask questions. They might make mistakes, um, all of those things. Thank you. Oops. That's okay. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Hi, I'm with Makula, Maya, and Jack. Jack, what do you guys have? Uh, a hallway token. Makula, how do you, did you get the hallway token? By walking respectfully in the halls. Maya, what does safe hallways expectation look like? Um, face forward when we're walking, using walking feet, and keeping our hands to ourselves. Also, it would be helpful not to scream Baby Yoda every time you come out into the hall. What do, Makula, what do 
What does do respectful hallways expectation look like? By being silent when walking, by listening to our teachers, school and adults directions. Jack, how can we be responsible in the hallway? Bye bye. We can be responsible by going with directly where we're supposed to be going. Thank you, Falcons. Let's model good hallway behavior. Now for Sprucewood current events. CBM testing is on Tuesday and Wednesday. No school Friday, January 17th or Monday, January, January 20th. See you next week, Falcons! Thanks for watching the Falcon!